a lot of uh, companies in the quantum world they're doing the research they're developing all these different devices that you know they may be not sure where they're gonna fit exactly in terms of real-time applications Here at the booth of Keysight, I met Mauricio. Mauricio, please tell us about yourself, what you're doing here, and what this crazy machine is doing uh, behind us. <laughs> sure, sure, no problem. So, so just some background. Uh, my name is Mauricio, and I am the account manager uh, within Keysight for the southeast of the UK. Right, so that is usually most sales-related uh, inquiries. But, of course, we, we try to get all different teams involved within Kisa to, to make our customers happy and, and make sure we push a lot of these projects forward. Um, in terms of Keysight, right, we're a test and measurement company. For, for some of you uh, that don't know Keysight, we started as HP, Hewlett Packard, uh, who originally started with test and measurement products, uh, meaning anything to do with electronics from chipsets to testing satellites to testing uh, electric vehicles autonomous vehicles anything to do with electronics we basically develop the hardware the software and support with services to to help our customers push all these developments and projects forward on on the latest technologies being 5g quantum uh, some examples i give you are electric yeah. vehicles and, and these sort of, of things yeah, okay, okay. And what is it that uh, sets you apart from, from the other players on this market? What is it that uh, makes you special here? Well, you know, there, there are a lot of very uh, good companies out there, for sure, in the quantum space specifically, since we're at, at the quantum event. But, uh, you know, we, 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 we take quantum as, as a strategic mm -hmm. industry of development, like the UK government does, and our aim is to support a lot of the big players, a lot of the startups that are pushing a lot of these technologies to to make this a better world. So, so you know, we, we, we try to support all the companies to, yeah. to the best that we can. As far as I understand, uh, quantum technologies are not really applied to real life uh, problems yet, right? Uh, so, so how do you make your money? Is this uh, all like research and investment or is this uh, actually something uh, where you already apply stuff uh, for your customers? Kisa is, is, is a large company, right? Yeah. And we have a broad range of solutions. Uh, the, the area where we play into is a lot of uh, companies in the quantum world, they're doing the research, they're developing all these different devices that, you know, they're maybe not sure where they're gonna fit exactly in terms of real-time applications. Uh, what we develop is, for example, hardware uh, combined with software to allow a lot of these new companies or, or big drivers of the industry to test a lot of these concepts and, and develop them, right? So, so basically support uh, that R&D front of quantum. Uh, yes, through through projects that sorry through products that exist today. Uh, yes, yeah. In brief, <laughs> and and we are going to have like a close up of this machine because it it really bugs me what what it is that we are seeing here. <laughs> yes, yeah, so so this is our UXR oscilloscope. Uh, and I guess for those of you who don't know, in very, very simple terms, an oscilloscope captures uh, signals in the time domain. But these, as, as time has moved forward, the, the, the oscilloscopes that we now have uh, are much more complex. They test a lot of RF concepts and communications. And uh, in the quantum world, one aspect of it at least is testing uh, very fast pulses and, and machines like real-time bandwidth oscilloscopes enable a lot of customers to test uh, those very fast pulses that, that are quite common. And uh, did you hear any of the talks here at the conference so far, or are you like chained to your booth? Yeah, so I haven't <laughs> had the luck yet. Uh, some of my colleagues are at the different talks, but of course we need someone here, man in the booth, yeah. uh, and, and waiting for, for some of the customers that drop by and talk to us, yeah. of course. Yeah, yes, yeah. but I will be hopefully later today. Yeah, of course. No, I, I really uh, enjoy the, the sphere here and uh, having like all these uh, experts in this field and actually learning quite a lot about the applications, the fields and challenges, um, and also now the hardware, of course. Yeah. Of course, yeah, no, <laughs> likewise, likewise. So I'm, I'm not the expert in quantum, but of course it's very fascinating to talk to a lot of the professors, a lot of the universities, a lot of these startups full of you know, multidisciplinary experts uh, are learning more about this. All right. Mauricio, thank you so much for your insights and have much fun at the conference. Likewise. <laughs>